There are eight sections of the course, uh, and each of the sections, from finance to human resources to legal, business development, technology and business, facilities management, marketing, and process and management and production. The course explores uh, also in various sections, not just the corporate business side of the business world, but it also explores personal aspects that are related to business. So in the finance section, not only do we explore uh, financial statements, business planning, strategy development, what is a 10K, how does that all work? But we also flip it to the personal side and we talk about mortgages, we talk about uh, who wins with the credit card, what is a credit card, how does it work, who wins with the minimum payment being made. Uh, the course is designed to explore those types of things for your personal growth and also to give you a better understanding of the world of business. It's not designed to take students at the high school level where I've taught this course and I've concepted this course uh, and, and taught it at the at the high school level. It's not designed to drive them to go and become undergraduate business majors and it's certainly not designed to drive students at the college level to go off and get their MBA. It's designed to help them enhance their ability that whatever you want to do with your career it's good to know these things to enhance your experience, to enhance your opportunity, to enhance your return, however you want to classify it. What I really like about Oberlin students is that they clearly have an interest in and an appetite for this type of curriculum. That to me has come through very loud and clear um, because of their reaction in the classroom and how we've gotten a very high level of participation from a group of 30 students. It's a lot of personal enhancement and personal growth. That is the focus of what we're trying to accomplish. The name I concepted for it was Business for Life and it's meant to be life enhancing more than anything else, which is a lot of what I think the liberal arts perspective is, is to enhance the life of a student's experience and to, and to enhance a student's life overall by broadening their mind, broadening their awareness, broadening their experience from an educational standpoint.